Hi, I'm uh, Raimonds from uh, EasyBI. I would like to tell you about EasyBI add-on for Jira. With EasyBI, you can create custom Jira reports, charts, and dashboard gadgets. You can create pivot table style reports using easy drag and drop user interface. In these reports, you can uh, use many different measures like number of issues created or resolved or estimated or uh, actual hours as well as time spent in uh, workflow transition statuses. You can uh, present the data also using different chart types like bar, line or pie charts and many others. In addition, you can use many uh, so-called calculated measures in your reports. There are very many calculated measures that are predefined in EasyBI for most frequent needs, as well as you can uh, create your own calculations. Now let's have a look at short demo of EasyBI. At first, you need to select Jira projects that you would like to analyze as well as select custom fields you will need in the reports. After initial data import, regular automatic data synchronization will be performed. Several sample reports will be created for you to explore EasyBI capabilities, for example, created versus resolved issues chart, which also includes average resolution time and open issues over time. In these sample reports, you can change project or issue type or any other page dimension selection. But now I wanted to show you how easy it is to create a new report from scratch. Let's build unresolved issues by priorities report. Here you can see all available dimensions and measures that you can use in reports. In our report we will use issues due or unresolved issues measure on columns and priority dimension on rows and we'll expand to detailed priorities list. We will put project dimension on pages so that we can select either all projects or one specific project. Now we can modify our report and add assignee dimension on rows to see how unresolved issues are split by individual assignees. And then we can put status dimension on columns to see split of unresolved issues by corresponding issue statuses and show just non-empty columns. From any cell with total number of issues, we can drill through to the list of individual issues that are included in this total. We can also highlight any exceptions using conditional cell formatting rules. In this case, we will highlight large number of reopened issues. Now, when we have selected data that we are interested in, we can present the data as a chart. We will use a bar chart style, switch to stacked bar chart, and then we can customize other chart layout options or visual styles, like color. If our report looks nice, then we can save it and give it a name, and we will be able to open it later and see updated data using the saved report layout. All saved reports can be included in Jira dashboard pages as well. In a Jira dashboard, select EasyBI report gadget and then pick from the list our CI report. And we have it in the Jira dashboard page. We can interact with this EasyBI report gadget in the same way as before. Change page filter conditions like selected project or issue type or drill into more details. Did you like it? Then uh, start 30 day free trial and if you have uh, any questions then feel free to contact uh, EasyBI support. Thank you.